today's No Filter, discusses the topic of media and how they like to exploit people for their mental illnesses. Toby Shelton is a 33-year-old man, he's a singer-songwriter in Los Angeles, who allegedly spent $100,000 on plastic surgery to look like Justin Bieber. Now, the press has been reporting about this, the story has gone viral, and people really like making fun of him because, oh my god, he looks like a freak. I mean, he spent so much money on these fillers and the chin reduction and all these different surgeries that make him look a little unrealistic. But I actually think that there's a huge problem with the way the press is covering this story. Look, if someone has a condition like this, which I believe is body dysmorphic disorder, you don't tear him down and make fun of him. If anything, you know, you treat this type of story with a little bit of sensitivity. Now, he started having plastic surgery at the age of 23 when he had three different hair transplant procedures. Now, already you know that this kid has a little bit of a problem, and I'm not saying that because I think plastic surgery is wrong in all instances. I actually have a pretty open mind when it comes to plastic surgery. But when someone spends $100,000 on plastic surgery to look like a specific celebrity, there are obviously issues there. So instead of discussing the prevalence of body dysmorphic disorder or discussing how this guy probably needs some sort of professional help for the problem that he has, people have decided to make fun of him and to basically tear him apart in the press, which I have a huge, huge problem with. Now, I don't want to come off as a hypocrite and I want to make sure that I disclose how I have done the same thing in the past. Five years ago, we used to talk about Heidi Montag, who had 10 different plastic surgeries procedures in one session and we would make fun of her because we felt that she was just a fame whore and that she was so self-absorbed and obsessed with the way she looked but the reality is you know these types of insecurities and these types of thoughts that people have about themselves should be discussed in a professional way in a sensitive way and I really hope that people change their tune when it comes to dealing with Toby Sheldon and this isn't me trying to be self-righteous this is me trying to step back and think about a story from a completely different perspective um, now, I should also note that $100,000 is a significant amount of money to pay for plastic surgery, and I think that a discussion about the moral obligation of plastic surgeons should also come up. When is enough enough? Should plastic surgeons allow people to have as many surgeries as possible? Shouldn't they step back and think, hey, you know what, this person might have a little bit of a problem. Let me rethink whether or not I am going to allow this procedure to go through.